But we start tonight with breaking news. A police detective from New Berlin firing shots this afternoon on Milwaukee's north side. Police just releasing new information within the last half hour. That scene unfolding this afternoon near 56 and Locust. And that's where we find Miriam McCarr. She talked to neighbors and she's live there now to tell us what happened. Miriam? Yeah, that's right, Charles Shannon. As you mentioned, we just received an update from police just a few minutes ago detailing what exactly took place earlier this afternoon. So police were in search of a stolen vehicle that was taken from the city of New Berlin. They were conducting that search in this area. When they found the vehicle, they said that a critical incident then occurred where a detective began firing his weapons. Now, earlier this afternoon, I spoke to some neighbors who told me what they saw. We're in a red Toyota. There's two subjects. One's hit. The other one's somewhat listening. You can hear over scanners this afternoon's tense exchange between officers and two people during an incident on the city's north side. I'm a vet. I've been to war. Um, and this is just, it's reminiscent of what I've seen and what I've been through. And our community, we got to do better. Michael Robinson was on his way home from the store around 3 this afternoon when he noticed dozens of police cars making their way to his neighborhood. I just hear police coming from everywhere, firefighters. I just hear all the sirens. I seen it all the way down from Burla all the way to Locust. Robinson says he heard a high speed chase led officers to his block. The fire department said they were called to the scene on a medical request from MPD. Two people were taken to the hospital for injuries. My only message to my community is that we got to pull over, put the guns down and stop the violence. Seeing this happen on his street, making Robinson think about safety for his own kids who are out in the neighborhood every day. I have a child. It's numerous other people that have kids and kids like to, to play outside and we want to be able to have our kids to be able to play outside and be safe and not have to worry about getting ran over, get hit by a car that's running from the police or get hit by stray bullets when you're having a shootout with the police. We live in a, a, a beautiful place. Milwaukee is a beautiful city full of beautiful people. We got to come together. We got to do better. And just about an hour ago, we actually saw police towing two vehicles away from this very street. Now, police say both of the detectives were not injured and the two suspects were taken to the hospital with non life threatening injuries. They're both in custody of Milwaukee police right now, pending those charges. And police also say there were several firearms in that suspect vehicle. For now, reporting live near 56th and Locust, Miriam McCarr, TMJ4 News. All right, Miriam, thank you.